Good morning, fifth graders. Happy Monday, April 20th. Welcome back to a new week of school. This week we have five days of school, five days of lessons. Then you will have off school next Monday. It's another teacher planning, teacher work day. So five days this week, four days next week. You get a three day weekend in between there. So fifth graders, keep up the great work. Keep checking in with those lessons. Remember to check Google Classroom each day. I'll put all the announcements on that first page called the stream. And then you have your book club pages. Each book club has a page on Google Classroom where you can find your reading calendar. I updated that a little bit, um, but I forgot to take next Monday off. So I'll be changing it again and switching those days around a little bit. But keep, make sure you keep up with your reading. If you read ahead, make sure you don't spoil anything on your group Google Doc. Um, so make sure you check Google Classroom and let me know if you have any questions. Uh, joke of the day today. What did the snowman say to the other snowman? Do you smell carrots? There's my joke. Hope you enjoy it. I have one on our... Uh, class conversations page as well if you want to check it out. If you have a good joke, share it with me and I'll give it to my kids. We're in jokes lately. All right, so for reading today, reading you have A Thief of Always Read Aloud, one chapter to listen to. It's not too long. You have a book called Mufaro's Beautiful Daughter, which I read in the lesson but you can't see the pictures when I'm reading in the lesson. So if you're interested in listening to it again and seeing the pictures, you can click on that read aloud link. And there's also my reading lesson for today. So Thief of Always, Mufaro's Beautiful Daughter, and watch the lesson, please. We do have a writing prompt today. Make sure you do that writing prompt on your book club Google Doc. You don't have to submit it in Google Classroom. Just do it right on your book club Google Doc. Make sure you put your name, put the date, so I know who is doing which amazing entries. All right? So that's reading. Math today, um, I believe it's a lesson from Mr. Cerrone or Mr. Rob and some pages. I haven't posted them yet because um, I'm still talking to the teachers, but they will be up soon. Remember, on days that we do not have a video lesson, Dreambox is optional. If there, if there is no video lesson, Dreambox is required. If there is a video lesson, Dreambox is optional. Please make sure you are using Dreambox. That's a great resource. It's pretty fun. Um, try it for 20 minutes a day. It'll be awesome. I think about three of you still have not signed in. So please let me know or have moms and dads email me if you are having trouble logging in. I know a couple of you have did and we can get that fixed quickly. Okay, so reading, math. Remember I have all those awesome virtual field trips and specials activities like art and music and lots of videos posted on Google Classroom. If you go to, there's a section called videos. There's also a section called extra fun stuff. Um, so I have math videos, reading videos, science videos, check those out um, if you are looking for something to do. Um, also today there is a survey from Ms. Posnanski that she would like all kids to do. It was emailed to parents, so maybe you've done it already. If not, the link is on my lesson pages. Please click through that survey. It's a Google form. It's pretty quick. Just seeing how you're doing and what else school can do to make this virtual learning work for you. So we want to make sure you're all doing well. Um, let's see, check my list here. Make sure you're checking those Google Docs. Make sure you're putting your math pages onto your slideshow. Please let me know if you have questions. You can comment or write right on those slides and I will see them. I check those every day. On Newzella, we will have Newzella assignments this week, Tuesday and Thursday. I already posted the Newzella assignment, but please do not do it yet. Ms. Rosinski is doing Newzella lessons on those days and she will be going through it with you and telling you exactly what to do. So please don't start that until after you watch her lesson on Tuesday. Okay, so Newzella is Tuesday and Thursday. She will give you directions in her lesson. You will know exactly what to do with that. Um, and attendance. Please make sure you're reaching out, talking to me at least once every day. So that could be submitting an assignment, chatting, emailing, um, 
book club meetings. Just make sure I hear from you in some way. Otherwise, I need to mark you absent for the day. Okay, so even if you just send me an email, say, hey, I'm kind of busy with my little brother and sister today, but I'm here. Perfect. I'll mark, I'll mark you here. All right. Uh, book clubs today. There are two book clubs, one at 10 o'clock, one at 1020. Remember, um, those are posted on Google Classroom and on our reading lessons page, the dates and times for your book club. Every book club will meet twice this week. So you'll either be Monday, Wednesday or Tuesday, Thursday. I will put the link for the Google Meet at the top of your book club page, the one that you will write on. So if you're meeting at 10 o'clock today, a few minutes before 10, you probably want to head over to that Google Doc page and about 9.58, you'll see me come on there and I will paste the link. Uh, I'm still working on figuring out how to set up those meet links ahead of time. Um, so they're there and you can just click on it. But I'm still learning how to do many of these computer and virtual things. So we'll do it this way for now. Uh, once the book club is over, I will delete the link. So if you're late or you miss it and you go to the page and it's not there, that's why. Because I have to take it away. Otherwise, you will click on it and you'll be in someone else's book club or just no one will be there. And that's okay. If you're busy, if you miss it, it's okay. I want to see you all as much as I can. To, this week we'll have some morning times and some afternoon times um, just so I can try and reach everyone. So please join us if you can, even if it's just for a few minutes. Last week when I had book clubs, we talked about the books a little bit, but mostly we just kind of checked in and see if you have any questions about anything and how you're doing. All right, so it'll be fun. Please join me. I think that's it. Have a great Monday, fifth graders. Hopefully I see many of your faces today. Have a fantastic week. You can do it. Remember to keep up with that work. Keep up with your read alouds. Let me know if you have questions about anything. You can email me on my Gmail. You can write on a Google Doc. You could even start your own Google Doc and share it with me if you want to do that. Um, whatever works for you, just please feel free to reach out if you need to. Have a great day. Don't forget to share my joke. What did one snowman say to the other? Do you smell carrots? Send me any good jokes if you have them and I'll share them. Have a great day, fifth graders. See you later. Bye-bye.